and welcome back. If you didn't watch my other video, the AFL Finals Week 1, I am doing the exact same thing as you probably tell it. It's the Rugby League Finals Week 1 predictions. So let's get right into it. The ladder. This is how the ladder ended up. Your money and premierships winner, Sydney Roosters, unfortunately. Coming in at second, my team, the Brisbane Broncos, have been for a very long time, so I hope they win. It's been, it's been almost 10 years since we last won a premiership, so hopefully this, this is the uh, third place, North Queensland Cowboys. Um, pretty good team up there. At fourth, so hopefully I got that right. If I didn't, you can correct me. At fourth, Melbourne Storm. They, they really they, they had an alright season. They, they just caught up to fourth place there in the last final weeks. In fifth, Canary Bulldogs. Six, Cronulla Sharks. So you think I'm forgetting what the teams are? Because, you know, I've only got, like, some of it written down, but... Yeah, don't hate me. In... What place is that? That's seventh. So, South Ritz... The... 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 the South Sydney Rabbitohs. And uh, to finish off that ladder for finals is St. George Illawarra Dragons. It's a good it's a good top eight. Really good top eight. Um, it's probably some surprising the Sharks, definitely. Um, I believe they were near the bottom of the ladder last year. So they've really turned that around. And the Dragons. Thought they were going to miss finals. Because they had a great start of the season. Um, and then they kind of went down a bit. Uh, just, just a little bit there. They, they were at first for a very long time. Probably not first, but they're, they're one or two uh, for a very long time. I know that much. Let's get right into the rounds. Friday, the qualifying rounds. The first game. First versus fourth. Sydney Roosters versus Melbourne Storm. At Allianz Stadium in Sydney. <laughs> Roosters should win. That's, they've just got the momentum coming off a, well, I think, 30 nil um, over South Sydney Rabbitohs. So they, they're, they're looking to they're looking to keep that, man, uh, that momentum going, um, possibly all the way to the grand final. Storm, they got they got questions over them. It's qualifying round, uh, Saturday, second versus third in good old Brisbane at Suncourt Stadium. Broncos versus so the Brisbane Broncos versus the North Queensland Cowboys. I'm always gonna go bro Broncos, um, pretty much because they're the best ever. No questions asked. They will. They'll beat Cowboys. Cowboys, I think, when they lost their man, I think Michael Morgan. I think it's Michael. I know it's Morgan. It might be Michael. Uh, to injury, they they've struggled in the in the halves there. Just organisation. So with John Thurston trying to command it all, it's going to be very tough. Going to be very challenging for him. So. We'll see. We will see how that goes. Now, I believe, last of all, they should be elimination rounds. If not, I look stupid. But the elimination rounds, the first on Saturday, 5th versus 8th, Canterbury Bulldogs versus St. George Illawarra Dragons at ANZ Stadium in Sydney. It's, yeah... Their coach, Des Hasler, has got uh, it, it's something in finals with him. He's, he's just drawn to it. I mean, you know, everyone knows he led Manly to their, to their grand final against the Warriors a few years ago. So, it, I, won't, I won't be surprised if they win. But one thing is that is, I believe, I think I heard this right. If not, Trent Hodgkinskin had... Bear, 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 bear. Trent Hodgkinson. No, I'm not even going to say it, you know, because that's just a ridiculous last name. I ain't saying nothing. 
um, is out, I believe. The pivotal half there. So yeah, that's that's gonna be. I reckon that's gonna be a close one, closer than people think. Benji Marshall definitely fires up, uh, brings his magic to the game. They will definitely win. The last game for the round is six versus seven. So that is the Cronulla Sharks versus South Sydney Rabbitohs at Sydney in Allianz Stadium again. I believe, I believe, if I read the reports right, that Greg Inglis is back for the Rabbitohs. So gone by that, Rabbitohs win. Greg Inglis, I he's. Everyone thinks he's a great player. I've kind of been saying that he's been overrated the past few years. Um, he hasn't really shown me anything lately. Until, you know, the... When was it? What am I thinking of? The, sta the state of origin. He kind of really sparked and showed what he can do. Uh, so I'm, I'm really looking for him to have a, a really great final series. And, you know... But I don't want them to really get to grand final because I want a Broncos versus Cowboys grand final. That'd be a great final. My underdog for the league, league finals, um, it's gone by who's there. It's really hard to tell, but I would have to say, uh, yeah, the, the Sharks. Yeah, the Sharks have to be the underdogs in this final because, you know, they're kind of... You look at the other teams, the Roosters, Broncos, Cowboys, Storm, Bulldogs, Rabbitohs, Dragons, the big-name teams, you know, who've always been lingering around the, the finals area. Um, so, yeah, definitely, definitely the Sharks. And my surprise in the finals would have to be... I have to say that it is... Probably, again, the Sharks. Both underdog and surprise. Because um, if they beat the Rabbitohs, which I'm hoping they are. Um, but Rabbitohs, yeah. If they beat the Rabbitohs, that will be really surprising there. So, yeah. That is week one of the NRL Finals predictions. I hope you enjoyed it. If you agree with me, thank you. If you didn't, thank you again. Because if we all thought the same, the world would be something. Anyway, uh, we'll see you next week for the week two. Adios.